So we've got our party now. What levels we got here? Level 18, Antonio's level 8. He fights with a milk pan. His his rise to fame will be quite interesting, I'm sure. Um, so we have to go to Kuan. I don't think anyone told us where it was, but... I'm gonna guess that it's due south. Look out the window here, reflect on what's about to happen. But I think it's south. Because the Empire's to the north and they're a little mad about the whole... I don't actually know what their fucking problem is, they're just mad at us. Sergey, nice to see you. Board the boat. Little Chinese junk here. Kaku, um, how are we doing for money? We got a fair bit. Let's deck out Antonio, because why not, you know? Let's make Antonio the powerhouse here. Shoulder pads. Leather coat's garbage. Give him, I don't know, give him gloves. A chef wouldn't wear a cape. Come on. Antonio can't wear brass armor. But he can wear the guard robe. And a pointed hat for cooking. Why not? Of course, because he's a cook. Defense 37. He's a low level. Hopefully that's why he has half, half as much defense as everyone else, because he's a low level. We're going to make him powerful whether the game likes it or not. And it's going to take all of our fucking money, unfortunately. Every last bit? They use bits here? Hello, uh, do you know how to sharpen a milk pan? Yes. More power. Just sharpen the edges for when I bludgeon people with it. She can't handle it. 28 damage. It's the most powerful weapon in our arsenal now. More powerful than the Dragon Fang Staff. Get the fuck out of here. I have faith in Antonio. What do we have? We have an antique that needs appraising. Enemy marksmanship down. That's what a hazy crystal does apparently. Uh, defense rune piece, defense up. That goes on Antonio. I'm sure we'll regret that in several hours when Antonio is completely garbage. The lightning crystal will give that to Camille. So, we'll... ooh, enchant weapon with wind attribute. No, no. If anything, we'd give Antonio fire rune pieces for cooking, cause it's a, cause it's a pan. You know what I mean. Um, so yeah, let's give... Let's hand out these runes here. Sharpening your weapons? You better fucking believe it. Uh, rune fra- oh, no, 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 no. It's the crystal ball that attaches magic. Does this town have a crystal ball? Ah. Uh, we're off to Kuan then. Hopefully so. Ooh, let's, um... Oh Jesus, 68 hit points. Let's leave him in the back row, what do you say? We'll put him in the front row once he gets some hair on his chest. Your first battle, Antonio. Don't let me down. Here it comes! <laughs> oh shit, Antonio. What are you doing? You need big plays like that. I want to see big plays from Antonio. Oh, we're in some fucking trouble here. If he's gonna do three damage, we're in some fucking trouble. What's this? Power 54, 106. Okay, so that power needs to be way higher. 
Oh, he might be a dud character. Wow. We can make it work. Follow your dreams, Antonio. This here village of Kwan survives thanks to Master Lapont, yet that new military commander. If you cross the Imperials, there's no telling what they'll do. That new commander seems pretty mean, too. Lately, Master Lapon has been keeping to himself and refuses to see anyone. I don't like that. Armor's my business. Choose whatever you'd like. Karate uniform. Antonio can't wear the leather armor. Ooh, Antonio can use shields, though. That'll help. The emblem is an accessory, maybe? I hope it is, because we'll replace the gloves. The gauntlet's also for defense. Whoops. So... So he needs a karate uniform and a steel shield. Oh, Antonio. You're so wacky. Gloves? Yes. Perfect. We're gonna drag you to victory. What's this? Giovanni. I'm sorry, but my master Lapon is very busy and cannot see you. When will he be free? I don't know. Tomorrow, perhaps? Or the day after, or in a month, or even a year? That doesn't help. That doesn't fucking help me, Giovanni. Don't go in there. The commander will be furious. Ah, uh, yeah, that's just what they're gonna do. Okay. Ooh! Are you an appraiser? Something to appraise? I've got this weird urn. Appraising. The results are in. Uh, do you want it? Ugh. You can use some of the things that you appraise to decorate your castle, but... We need all of our money to... Help Antonio not get the shit kicked out of him. Um, we haven't been in the inn yet. Hopefully someone in the inn will help us. Hello? Who are you? Hmm, the Liberation Army, eh? T sure. Gee, I don't know. Forget it. I don't hang around with weaklings. So she's gonna be a big cunt until we level up. You went to LaPant's mansion? Hoo-hoo! <laughs> you guys would never get in, even if you spent years in front of his house. I have a much better plan. Care to hear me out? You'll get to meet LaPant. Tell me what you have in mind. Good, but this is not the place. Let's go to the inn. We're in the fucking inn, dude. It's like... <laughs> this is ten feet away. Let's hear what you have to say. Don't rush me now. Do you know why LePant won't see anyone? Why? He doesn't want to get involved with guys like you who defy the Empire. That's why he refuses visitors. But why? That's not like what Matthew told us about him. I don't know anything about that. Anyway, let's get down to details. LePant treasures two things above all else. One is his wife, Eileen. The other is his great sword, Karinji. So... So if you steal Karinji, LePant will most certainly come after you. Then after you face him, you can talk to him or blackmail him or whatever you like. Understand? I see, so how do we steal Karinji? <laughs> Just leave that to me. Wait here a while, then come on over to LePant's house. I'll see you later. <laughs> are we pretending to be thieves now? How pathetic. Who's pretending we are thieves? Oh fuck, I forgot to give Gremio a wienery voice, because he's all wienery. It's about time we get going. Oh, it's about time we get going, young master. Oh my. Gremio. Oh, hello. Here you are. Wait just a moment. There, now you can go in. Aren't you coming? My job is done. Now it's your turn. I'll be waiting here. Ooh, a treasure chest already? Shoulder pads, ooh. No, gloves are shitty. Need a good pair of boots in the world of uh, whatever planet this is. All right, we've infiltrated his house and we're fighting a treasure chest. Okay. This is some experience for Antonio. 
What the fuck are you doing? That's fucking weird. We really gotta get that power up, Antonio. Oh, hey! Hi there, me? As you see, I'm just a warehouse guard. Are you people from the Liberation Army? I see. Mind if I ask you something? Is the Liberation Army's vault big? What, you don't have one yet? But do you plan to build a big one? I see, I see. Ah, fuck. Please let me join. How do I always skip that one window sometimes? Recruit. So thank you so much. Let's go and build a big one. How did he become a fucking wiener suddenly? I tried to meet you halfway and give you like this big muscle man voice. And then you're like, oh, let's b -b 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 build a vault. What's this? There's nothing in here. This kooky ass mansion. Oh. Do I fight the ones that I see? Uh, nope, you just fight stuff anyways. Neat. That's what Firestorm's for. Oh, nope, we forgot to sleep at the end. That's not what Firestorm's for. Oh, shit. We'll just free will this. The game figures out how to split the attacks up the best. Antonio just hit for one. We're getting the shit kicked out of us here. What do you say we just run? Dingus' party started to run off. So, yep, you bet your ass we did. This is why we bought so much, remember? Oh, jeez. This is why we bought all the medicine. Don't let him see ya. Get to this treasure chest here. A counter crystal. Well then. Um. Let's. You know what? Let's just go all out this time. Deadly fingertips on the back row. Antonio, don't fucking die. That's gonna be your job for the next few levels. Go! How about this? Oh, jeez. Even magic doesn't work on him very well. Keep at it with the magic and such. And, oh no, Cleo, you're the wizard. Wizardette, I suppose. Probably gonna kill Gremio here. Oh, young master, I do no damage. That's our fault for not powering up his, uh, his axe. I think he fights with an axe. Oh, look at that! Camille just totally took a hit for Gremio. I guess because she wants her money. We'll just use every single rune, whatever. Now, Antonio, normally we don't do this poorly, so I don't want you to think any less of the Liberation Army. You gotta have a little faith. Oh, jeez. Oh, that might be... Yep, that's a dead Camille. Oh, Antonio! It's gonna be just Victor left at this rate. We used every single rune on this one fight. We forgot to attach the, the new magic. 
Nobody does damage. This is just, this is fine. This is just more XP for Antonio. You gotta look on the bright side when this sort of thing happens. See, look at all this Antonio XP we're gonna get. See, here it comes. Oh, jeez. Every cloud has a silver lining. That's what we say in the Liberation Army, because if it turns out that's not the case, we're doomed to failure. Because it's like our first mission as an army, and we're getting the shit kicked out of us. He has less hit points than everybody. This is good. This is great. Less power, less speed, less everything. Oh, jeez. Just get the fuck out of this haunted room. Oh, treasure. Speed rune piece. That goes right on Antonio. Speed increased. He needs all the performance enhancing runes he can get his hands on. Triple exclamation point is everyone gets shit on. Tonio! There the damage is starting to come in now. I really want there to be a good one. We really should just clone room those guys. Also, we need to buy so much medicine when we get out of here. Holy shit. Look at this. Look at all this medicine we're tearing through. Hello? Just nothing in there. Man. It's a treasure chest factory. A fire room piece. That'll be for his frying pan, or sorry, a milk pan. Oh no, 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 but we're surrounded, we can't get away! Oh god! Just try again, oh shit! Remyo actually dodged one for once. But we're surrounded, I don't think we can get away from this. Careful! Oh, Dingus's party finally started to run off. It's in this treasure chest. Something to save our life? Leather armor. Nope. That was a dead chest for sure. Oh wow, leather armor is actually better. My mistake. My mistake, everybody. Medicine, thank god. White pig. Who the fuck is this? Jupo! My god, you scared me. Who are you, fellow thieves? How do you do? Who are you? Me? I'm Jupo the trickster. Who are you? Trickster? Did you make this contraption? That's right, that's right. Do you like it? You must be kidding. Hey, you, turn that infernal contraption off right now. Hmm, that may be difficult. The dolls I can shut off, but the big one, impossible. So enjoy it, Soldiers of Liberation Art. What the fuck are you- what? Oh, jeez. Just everyone go all out on one at a time. That's what we'll do. Stand a chance, I think, against just two. Fucking samurai robots. We found the stack of medicine, so we can heal this off. Oh. Don't make Antonio look bad, Victor. 
Antonio's coming together. He's not. He's he's gonna be dead weight the whole game. But I'm a man of my word, and we're gonna stick with him. What the hell is in here? What the fuck is this? What? Treasure! I just want to get across, though. I'd like to go up there. No, I don't. Gained 10 experience points, oh boy. I would just like to... No! Treasure! God damn it. And a bit of a pickle here. Ugh. I don't know if I have to press something or if it just ends on its own. Monster! Oh, goody. There's four of you, too. This is your last one. This is gonna be really dicey. I wonder if Antonio does more damage if he's in the front row. That's something we'll have to find out when we're not fighting these murder bots. Good hustle, Jamio. Just the clone room, this middle guy, which I don't think we... No, no, we killed the middle one because there were four to begin with. Ooh, good counterattack. Well, that actually killed him. Extra good counterattack. Oh, Free Will was done with me. They can't make up their mind. Oh, Young Master's in trouble. Oh. Man, everyone just saves his life. Don't hit Dingus. Jumps in the way. This is unfortunately a horrible experience. Good money, though. No! You lose experience? Jesus. Ugh. You're not gonna let me leave, are you, Jupo? Medicine acquired. Let me swing this block out. That changes nothing. Lose experience. Oh no. I'm okay with that if I can just get the hell out of here. I don't know what that, just, there's a chance it can actually land on nothing. Okay. Who built this? Like, who's goofy ass? Who would want this shit in their house?
Oh, more medicine. Oh, boy. Maybe let me get the fuck off? No? Monsters. So everybody go all out on this first one, I guess. Oh shit. That's what we got the medicine. Oh shit. So much damage. Holy shit, he's still alive. These guys take way too long. We had to use the clone rune on him. Cleo just saved his life there. Got the dude with the sword, I guess. Ooh, double dodge. Ah, uh, we'll burn it on the robot soldier. Ro they're robots. How does this house have robots? Oh no, we'll get to clone room. Big perk. Think again. Everyone's saving a niggas. Well, I actually guess it's just Cleo and Gremio. No, Camille saved his life, didn't he? Didn't she? All that, like a fight to the death for 100 or 200 experience points. That's just ridiculous. 